Super Videos back at you for another video. In this video, I'm going to be looking at the new cast members that were added to the opening credits of The Walking Dead. Now, of course, in my other video, I did talk about the opening credits being new and talking about Jeffrey Dean Morgan's name being added in as Negan. But after episode one, they ended up taking Michael Cutlitz and Stephen Yeun's name, who of course play Abraham and Glenn in The Walking Dead. They took their names out, which makes sense because they're no longer on the show. So they actually replaced it with three new members. And so in this video, I'm going to talk about that. So first we have Alana Masterson, who plays Tara. It's very interesting that they've actually added her to the opening credits because she doesn't have a major role, but adding her to the opening credits, which is cool. And for her, what we actually have is a grounded boat, which could be a few things, but where my mind goes is something to do with a new community that was in the comic book, which they didn't really spend a lot of time in the comic book, but it looks like they're expanding in the TV show and spending more time on, and that's the ocean side. And there's a specific character in the comic book that's linked to that community, but I won't talk about that here. And also, from the looks of it, this could also be related to the storyline for Heath and Tara, so it makes sense for her name to be on this, because, of course, there were pictures coming out of some sort of ocean or lake sort of location and a grounded boat just like this was seen in one of the pictures that were released not officially but by fans so it's probably something to do with that then we have Josh McDermott who plays Eugene we have his name added in so that's very cool and then we have the factory that him and Abraham visited back in episode 16 of season 6, which is basically a location they can build ammunition. So that's the significance of the machinery that's in this photo with Josh McDermott's name. And then we have Christian Serratos, who of course plays Rosita, but there's nothing significant about the picture that's accompanying her name. The only thing I can think of is some sort of symbolism because her name is in the middle of the shattered glass so being broken she's a broken person because of Abraham's death and of course we saw a little bit about her being broken in the premiere of season seven so it kind of makes sense and then of course we have Jeffrey Dean Morgan as Negan and I already talked about this but I'm just going to mention it quickly here as well the significant points in this are of course the end of the bat or Negan's Lucille but there's also another subtle thing in the background. If you look at the background, by the fireplace, you can see there is an iron. And for comic readers, that's a clear sign of something to do with Negan and Dwight. And there's a storyline behind the iron. Now, for non-comic readers, you probably don't know what that is, but I'm just going to give you a few hints. So if you look at Dwight, he has this burnt face, which he didn't have the first time we met him. So it's kind of linked with that and we're probably going to get to see that coming up in the next episode we're going to see which is episode three but that's it for this video thanks for watching i'll be back for another video